So, here's a real secret that I want to keep amongst us, if we could. Okay, don't tell anyone the secret, but I thought that as I got older, I would get kind of more uh, adept at organization and better at kind of like categorizing things and knowing where things were and putting things in spots because I've always been really good at that. I've always been really good at like storing things nicely and you know having a great inventory and sort of like keeping abreast of things better than a lot of people I know, okay? Who shall remain nameless. But here's the thing, as I get older, I don't care. <laughs> I care much less about storage of things because I guess like my time on earth gets shorter and shorter, so why do I care about where things are stored? You know what I mean? Like, take too much time. It takes too much time to worry about that. T time away from actually living my life. Like, these closets behind me, this is my cute office, right? It's a cute place. That's my big design studio. And, you know, like, these closets, I have no idea what's, what's in these it? closets. Look at this, wait a minute. Wait, look, look what's in here. Okay, wait, look, look at this, right? No idea. What is this? How did this get here? From the TED, oh, TED conference. conference. It's great. It's a year ago, okay. so it's just Guess been sitting what? there. I will never throw it away. It's my prized possession. Right. Okay. That's my prized possession, obviously, because it's in my closet behind my desk right. at my office. Right, my so it's a very room. important spot. It's a very important spot. There's a lock on the door of this closet, right? Because look how valuable everything is. Well, all this bags. Wait, it's all this is, bags. I know, I know, I know. It's all bags. So obviously I have a problem. This is a bag of my stage makeup for when I tape in there. This is my stage makeup, which I apply myself, okay? You can see that we have a large budget for the, uh, the web show. Um, what's in here? I don't even know what's... I should open this up and see what's in here. Look. Oh, right, I bought these beautiful... I bought these beautiful old belts. These are gorgeous, actually. And, and this been is put to good use. Been put yeah, to good put use to, in the yeah, back. I'm so glad I've used my, my beautiful... Look at this kooky hat. <gasps> Ooh. That's a good kooky little Tyrolean number. Isn't that a good 19th century Tyrolean number? Okay. What else do we have? In but here? again, just wrap it back up. and It's going to go yeah. back in the closet, right? right back in here because I don't know what... I'm so out of my... Look, I have this beautiful remnant of my own home collection, beautiful green squares, and this beautiful remnant of pink boucle, right, which is gone. Now, what's in here? What is this? Wow, this is really crazy. <laughs> this this? I'm big. scared to find out what this is. Okay, wait. More belts. The belts can't <laughs> get enough of the belts, right? More belts. A tape. A DVD. Uh, I'm not going to tell you what the videotape is, but... Oh, that's pretty. What is that? What is that? Where did this come from? What is it? Bow ties. Oh, bow ties. <laughs> bow ties. Oh, cummerbunds. Pink satin tie. That's actually kind of nice, right? That's crazy. What is that? What is that doing here? Cute little Target bag, right? Wow, this is nuts. What's in here? What is it? Something with a chain. It's a sporin, and I've been looking for this thing. Look at this, a sporin. <laughs> Now, More only, bags. Now, if I can only paper find bag, my kilt, it's Scottish yeah, bag. If I can only find my kilt. Now, this is not a bag. This is a sporan. This is just a symbol of, 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 of manhood, right? That you wear on your kilt, darling. There's no bag attached to this. Wow. Now, if I can only find my kilt. I'm sure it's in the closet kilt. somewhere. Oh, but this is a really good belt. Wait, I have to show you this belt. You ready? Wait a second. Okay, wait. I have to show you this. This is a belt from an old collection of mine. Hilarious, right? Like a Jewish star. Because I was sick of crosses on everything. Like when Chanel was happening with all the crosses and the Maltese crosses and crosses. I was like, no, you know what? We need an Etoile Juif, darling. An Etoile Juif. And there it is. And I will never throw that away. That's a good one. And then guess who sent me this belt? It says Mitzi, right? Mitzi. This is really old. This is literally like 25 years old, this belt. It won't fit. I'm not going to even try it on right now. <laughs> Wait a second. This belt... Mitzi was Perry Ellis's nickname for me. Mitzi, like Mitzi Gaynor, Mizrahi Mitzi, right? Mark Jacobs sent me this belt. I Come promise on. you. This is, look, and it says, here it says, to Isaac, congratulations. I don't know what he was congratulating me about, but it says XXOO Mark. Right? There you go. Yeah. 
Mark Jacobs sent me this book. What else is in here? It'll be in the museum someday. <laughs> right, exactly. <laughs> oh, look, speaking of Mark, a cute Louis Vuitton <laughs> belt. This is actually cute. This could get worn. I probably, like, the minute he took the job, I was like, throw this out. <laughs> yeah, exactly. All right. No, no, I don't know. I'm oh putting my them all God. back in the bag and then going back, back in the closet. closet. And we'll and come back in, in, in a year. And check me out in 20 years from now. And we will go back over and find the spore and again and find the Mark Jacobs belt again. All right? Bye-bye. Now I have to put this all back. <laughs> Can I get an assistant to come in here and put this back? I've had it. Okay. I'm late for a meeting. Bye. <laughs>